Apple Creek YMCA has a very unique history and vision. Um, we are actually a gift from a single donor family and they gifted us the land and the money to be able to build this YMCA. Bruce and Barbara Purdy were very, very passionate about environmental education. In fact, back in the 50s and 60s when kids would go on what they called conservation days, environmental education trips, they would go to the Purdy farms to learn about bugs and dirt and animals and plants. Bruce and Barbara Purdy did that for many, many years. Since they are past, we wanted to embrace their passion and provide that kind of opportunity for school children and families in our community. So the Apple Creek YMCA is, is now a destination for all those unique studies for children. Everything we do is really aimed at getting people involved in the outdoors. So whether it's our gardening program, whether it's our nature preserve and taking people for a hike, it's really to get people active and outdoors all seasons of the year. We talk a lot about healthy living and how people can make better choices in the foods that they eat, uh, foods that they grow on their own or foods that they can purchase from a farmer's market or something like that are, are very important for uh, keeping food local but also for their health. Um, but also for social responsibility, teaching people that we don't have to truck foods across the country in order for them to get fresh food. It's really funny when you ask kids where their food comes from. Uh, a lot of the times when we bring up questions like, where does milk come from? They won't say it comes from a cow, they'll say it comes from the grocery store. Having a fork farm has been such a blessing to extend our growing season. We did have our first harvest and we actually brought the entire fork farms upstairs and had some information out and we gave away about 50 quart sized bags of lettuce to the members and was gone in a couple hours. The freshness and the, fla the flavor, I think it tastes better. I don't like the lettuce from the store anymore. To offer this opportunity of planting and nurturing and harvesting something that you cared for, it's a very satisfying satisfying thing to do and it's so wonderful that we can provide this gardening opportunity for more people and hopefully impact their health and well-being as well.